Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here and just happen to stumble upon my page, my name is Halima, aka Halle Berry. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so welcome to my channel, and if you're oldie but a goldie, welcome back. So anyway, um, gosh, today the British weather has been absolutely redonkulous. Redonkulous. I don't know whether that's a good word or a bad word, but it's it's bad, you guys. It's been raining, like, ever since I woke up, and I've been trying to, because I, I need to do some errands today, and I was going to take you guys along with me, because I'm going to go on, um... A little thrift little shopping day today as well whilst i do my errands i was just going to take you guys with me and just film some kind of like little vlog just because this week has been a bit hectic you know um getting presents sending off presents it's just been a bit mad insane crazy and also also ramadan the first i know i'm a little late it is the third day can you believe it it's the third day is what <laughs> I don't know, I, wow, it's so wow, it's the third day of Ramadan, you guys, here in the UK, um, anyways, I hope you guys are all having and enjoying your Ramadan with your families, your friends, your loved ones, and yeah, so today, anyway, like I said, I'm going to go off and do a little bit of charity shop, thrift, whatever you want to call it, and I'm going to take you guys along with me, and then, obviously, um, you know because it is charity shop it could be a hit or miss if i do end up finding stuff of course i will come back home and do a little try on haul for you guys depending on what i find actually um if not then at least you guys you know you could see where i shop and anyway it'll just be like a little vlog um so that's the video this week anyway i'd just like to say because it is ramadan i'd like to make a little announcement drum roll please okay anyway um, the announcement is that because it is Ramadan, I do have some, well, I've always had free time really. But anyway, um, it's Ramadan and, you know, people do the little, the little Christmas, like, you know, vlogs and stuff like that. Um, I saw basically, I got the idea from Shard. Shard is doing, if you have, if you don't, if not watch Shard, then, you know, click on our YouTube channel. So I got the idea from her. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to do it every single day because I'm not quite as, as, advanced as some of these you know fellow youtubers but you know your girls get in there so what i'm gonna do is just i'm just gonna film whenever i want to film basically obviously every thursday is gonna be you know it's a must you know what i'm saying so you're gonna get my thursdays um thursday videos but also i'm gonna try and film maybe one other day if i can just like random days i'll just film across this month of ramadan just like of like you know it could be ramadan related it could be not it could be just something random but anyway you just have to wait and see and you just have to make sure that you are part of the notification gang 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 or if you're not click it down below and then you get notified whenever i do upload a video just because you know i haven't confirmed what days it is so it would just be random days whenever i feel like it you know what i mean you guys Cause sometimes you get a little bit stressful sometimes get a bit a little hardy in the uk i'm joking we all have busy lives you know what i'm saying so anyway that's that I'm gonna take you guys with me, so I'll see you guys later. Oh, oh my gosh, I think I'm losing my voice. <laughs> see you later. Hi, you guys. So I'm just at the bus stop. I'm just waiting for my bus to come, and it's taking ages. And it's looking like it's about to rain once again. I hope it doesn't rain. Like this is why I wish I lived in central London because it would be just so easy get like just getting around to places with just like you know just going through the tube but here it's like i live just outside of london so it's just so difficult but you know what it's fine if it's gonna rain let it rain because i can make it through the rain anyways i think that's my bus you know what i think the bus is here god's on my side hey you guys so i'm just i'm actually in farnham road um uh, which is like near the area where i live yeah i'm gonna run my errands and then i'm gonna try and find some charity shops i've got one in mind already bernardo's that's my, my, my favorite actually and then afterwards then i can go and shop and find other ones so um just post 
popped into the post office to um, just drop something off for my Depop shop customers. And then now I'm just doing this last errand and then um, we can go charity shopping. <laughs> Gosh, it's so windy outside and actually it's quite cold and I don't have a coat, so maybe I could try and find a coat. Okay, you guys, so the UK is currently a shithole because it is raining. So off I go, I'm gonna go into Barnardo's now. I can finally do my nice little charity shop. I'm so, so excited because whenever I go to my other local Barnardo store, they have such, such amazing stuff in there. Like I always come up with a bag with at least five, two, with at least two items in there at least. So I'm very excited and I'll take you along with me and show you guys. Lovely, lovely. Hey guys, so I went into this other charity store. I'm not sure what it was called, but it was really rubbish. But anyway, I'm here now at Barnardo's. You, let's go. So I've just come out of um, Barnardo's and I didn't end up getting that many that many things but that's okay um, like I said it's always a hit and miss it was actually a really good shop that they've got like I filmed a little bit in there and they've got so many stuff in there like it's such a it's literally an all clothes store and they've got so much clothes in there I found a few bits but I didn't want to spend like you know like crazy but anyway I'm in Sue Rider now so this Sue Rider is actually really amazing because it has furniture as well can you see like like look at these chairs look at this chair and it's 89.99 and then look they've got all these nice little ones they've actually got like i remember coming in here before we're actually with my sister and she found a bag which she really liked well we both really liked but she got it <laughs> but I really like this store anyway, so we're in here now. Hi you guys, I've just come out of Sue Rider and I really like that charity store, like um, it's really big as well. Okay, so I'm gonna go to this other charity store I just found right now. It's called Harlington Hospice. I've never been to this one before, like ever. I've never seen it actually. So I'm just gonna go in. Oh, is it? Oh, okay, they're closed. What day is it today? Oh, there we go. Have they closed for lunch or? No. <laughs> is anyone in there? Okay, never mind. So they closed that. I'm not sure why it says that they close at five, but they, but then the doors are all shut. So never mind. Anyway, um, so yeah, Sue Rider. Sue Rider was a really good store. Like they've got furniture in there as well. Like I wish I had a house, and then I could buy all this lovely furniture in there. That's so cheap. Did you see those sofas and those chairs? Like everything is just crazy cheap. And yeah, um, I got a few bits. Unfortunately, none of them were actually clothes, which is what I was going for anyway, but that's fine. And then Bernardo's was okay. Um, and then I think that's it. That's all, that's all the furniture, that's all the charity stores that they've got in Farnham Road. I don't think they have any more. I could try and Google to see if they do, but I can't be bothered anyway. Um, I'm just going to head home right now. And then I'll show you guys what I found. Let you guys if it's worth coming down to Farnham Road to come and charity shop. Probably not, but I guess we'll just see how it goes. Um, see what I find all together. And then I'll let you know. All right, see you when I get home, bye. Hi guys, so I'm at the bus stop just waiting for my bus to go back home. Luckily I made it to the bus stop right in time because it is why is my nose so red? My nose so red. Like, why, why are you so red? Anyway, I think it's a reflection from the job. No? Okay. So anyway, I made it right in time. Look at the weather right now. It is chalking it down. 
is locking it down. Hey, you guys, I just got back home right now and um, right on time because it's literally like, it stopped a bit when I was on the bus, like I said, and then I literally walked it home and it was fine. And now it's like chucking it down once again. So I don't really know what's going on in the UK, but anyway. <laughs> anyway. We'll just jump straight into the little haul that I have for you guys right here. So like I said, I didn't really get much. I went to three charity shops. One was closed. I went to Age Concern, which was on the Farnham Road in Slough. So Age Concern, it was okay. Actually, to be honest, Age Concern was the worst one. I look for like whether there's goodies inside the store and there was nothing in there. So it was pretty, pretty shit. Um, I walked straight out and then I went into Bernardo and um, I wasn't disappointed and like it's a big store um, I'll put up a clip whatever and there was like, quite a few bits in there um, but like I could have bought them but I mean I thought it's unnecessary like obviously like I just don't need I, don't, I didn't need it so I didn't buy them but um, I, I did buy a few bits from there I'll show you just right now so I ended up getting this jumper. I'm not gonna try this on because I really can't bother. I ended up getting this like jumper. It's, it looks like a crop jumper, but then it's got this little bit at the bottom. I don't know, I'll see how it looks on. And what I might do is actually just chop it off and make it crop regardless. I did, I bought it because of these sleeves, these like big sleeves. So it's gonna be quite baggy on me. And then it's got like a polo neck. So it's like a granddad jumper. And I also really like the detail, like the gold buttons on the jumper here. So it's just like a really nice, like spring summer piece which would be like really nice so i can i could pair them up with like i'm thinking my vision inside my hair so maybe i like pair it up with like maybe some culottes i think that would look really nice and some boat shoes yeah i think that could look really nice or even like culottes and boots Ooh. or like white trainers you know can't go wrong with white pale pencils and then I also got this. So when I looked inside, this is actually Atmosphere, which is if you know if you know Primark, you know Atmosphere is Primark. So I got this, but you can't go wrong. So that jumper I got for fifty pence. This is why Bernardo's is my all-time favorite charity shop. So that jumper was fifty pence, and it's and the the it says Saint Michael. I'm not really sure what that is. If you know please comment below like you can see that it's a very good jumper material um and then yeah like i was showing you so this was from premark and i just got this because well i actually do need it and stuff like this are like i would say if you're looking for like tops to wear inside like like uh, inside dresses top tops to just like just everyday tops or white shirts charity shops are the best places to go so that was 50 pence that jumper and this was also 50 pence like you know, if I went to Primark, Primark, ooh, okay. <laughs> if I went to Primark, I definitely wouldn't have, I wouldn't have found this for like 50 pence. There's probably nothing in Primark for 50 pence, like clothing wise. So I got it because it's just, you know, like I said, I need it and I could wear it like, it's very light, very flimsy and I could wear it like inside like, you know, a dress, inside a top that's, you know, that I need to like cover my arms with, so any short sleeve top or even just like a jumper, anything. I also like these like rib little hands as well. I've never seen this top on Primark to be honest. I mean, I know Primark do lo lots of like little bobs and like that and it is cropped, which is quite nice because sometimes I just want something to wear on the inside of a dress or something, but I don't want it to be quite heavy because otherwise I'm just gonna be really hot. This is like for the summer by the way. So that was perfect. Effect of I and I needed it so and it was only 50 pence and then I picked up this book so I've actually been wanting to purchase this book and she's she's an amazing author actually um my my lecturer actually introduced shout out to John oh, oh. <laughs> my lecturer actually introduced me to do her I remember we, we were supposed to be doing my project about cancer and we ended up talking about Zadie Smith so and then he also recommended for me to read white teeth so I was on Amazon for ages trying to trying to get white white teeth but I think that they they were quite pricey if I yeah if I remember I think they were around about four pounds maybe or maybe more than that I mean I know that's not pricey actually it wasn't even four pounds I think it was like I think it was six pounds six ninety nine something like that or whatever but anyway if you'd like to get this book it is on Amazon and stuff like that but I managed to get it for 50 pence <laughs> so that's oh my gosh I legit look like Rudolph what is going on okay anyway 
so yeah 50 pence for that bargain anyway so in Sue Rider there were like I said there were some bits in there and now I'm kind of regretting not picking up this really nice velvet top but anyway I probably didn't need it but um I picked up a few bits in there um none, none of which were clothes first I got this this scarf which is really nice that the material is just absolutely amazing I don't know what material this is let me try and find the label um no there isn't a label there's only the Sue Rider label but there isn't a label so yeah so yeah I couldn't find a label but anyway just look at it it just reminds me of like Vincent van Gogh like it's very autumny but then you can still get away with wearing it in spring it's just very chic like you know you can tie it it's small enough to tie it on your bag and it's big enough to do a turban with so I got it because I was thinking like in the summer when I wear a lot of white stuff when I wear a lot of cream I need some colored like you know like hijab so I can do like turbans with really nice funky turbans or like you know just like go just like around my neck actually with like my outfits yeah and then I've got some vinyl vinyls so um you guys already know that I've got a record player I think I've showed you in one of my videos before um so in Sue Rider as well they were selling these for two pounds each so these did run a tiny bit pricey but there are vinyls and vinyls are quite pricey anyway so like in Brixton I think I got I got one for five pounds so so you know these for two pound each were pretty pretty damn good oh yeah and my scarf by the way this was one pound so bargain anyway um so I grabbed one which was Frank Sinatra because you know what, I never I never really knew about Frank Sinatra until I started working in um like I started, I did like care work for the elderly at some point of my life I did that and um and a lot of the old people loves Frank Sinatra so they and then I um yeah so they would always ask me to play Frank, Frank Sinatra on their like their on like their record players or whatever oh they all they'd have like cds and stuff like that and i liked it i liked the music they used to play on there and it should be just relaxing and stuff like that so um i grabbed this one i thought it would be really good and frank sinatra does a lot of like love songs as well and i'm a hopeless romantic you guys you know what i mean <laughs> anyways so i got this and i'm really excited to play this obviously i can't be playing it right now because it's ramadan and then i got nat king cole so this is another one that they used to love in the old people home but um yeah and then i listened to it and i used to really like it nat king cole is um quite famous actually so i i listened i listened to him before i went to the care home like some of his songs you know those songs that you don't really listen to but you like you hear them and they're like just like the old classics that make you boogie and put you in a good mood i feel like like old jazz music you know just that old classic music classical music they're the music that like the one-off songs that you remember that like, make you want to boogie that put you in a good mood so um i want to feel good you guys so i got nat king cole so um that's everything that i got today like i said it was okay shopping there today it wasn't all it but it was all right um yeah until next time catch you next time oh by the way also let me know in the comments below what kind of videos that you'd like me to do during this ramadan like i said i'm gonna try and do more videos than i usually do and that's it for me you guys hope you have a nice thursday because it's going up on thursday hope you've had a nice day hope you're enjoying your ramadan and um yeah i will be back next week or maybe sooner who knows anyway bye